The Bedford County Sheriff's Office is spreading the word, buckle up, live better. The new initiative comes after an increase in deadly car accidents where people were not wearing their seatbelts. As WSLS 10's Christina Craig explains, the sheriff is hoping that this effort gets repeat seatbelt violators to think twice and buckle up. Sometimes people forget to click it, but not Mountain View native James Crouch. I have a pretty large family, eight children, 16 grandchildren, six great grandchildren, and I wouldn't want to see none of them get killed or hurt in a wreck. Unfortunately, Crouch knows this pain. Six years ago on Route 24, his granddaughter was involved in a serious crash. She made it, but uh, she's crippled up from it. Crouch says the seatbelt saved his granddaughter's life. It's why he's helping the Bedford County Sheriff's Office spread the word on a new initiative. Buckle up, live better. We're going to be in everybody's face with this program. We don't like to see people killed in accidents. We don't like to, definitely don't want to see people who, for the lack of wearing a seatbelt, have been killed. This program comes after what Sheriff Brown calls a steady increase of fatalities, where drivers were not buckled up. In 2016, six people died while not wearing their seatbelt. The year before, five. And in 2014, three. The department is taking action by increasing traffic patrols September through October, giving warnings to seatbelt offenders. It does occur with some regularity that you... You pull somebody over and uh, you see them quickly reach back. Bumper stickers, yard signs, and banners are also available at the sheriff's office. Brown says he's hoping buckle up, live better spreads. In Bedford, Christina Craig, WSLS 10.